Hello students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting video, I would like to tell you something. Please sit with copy pen. If you find somewhere important, pause the video, note it and proceed on. If you find somewhere difficulty, then please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you once again. Now here is the question. An ideal gas is expanding such that Pt square equal to constant. The coefficient of volume expansion of the gas is. Here we have given four options. Option A, 1 by T. Option B, 2 by T. Option C, 3 by T. And option D, 4 by T. And this question is asked IIT J 2008. To solve this question, we are using ideal gas equation Pv equal to nRT. P can be written as nRT upon V. We have given the condition Pt square equal to constant. Now substitute this value of P. What is the value of P? N R capital T upon V and T square equal to constant. Now N R T cube upon V equal to constant. Then T cube upon V equal to constant upon NR. Here constant upon NR is also constant. So it can be considered let's say K dash. Okay. Now differentiate with respect of capital T both the side. Okay. So here D by d capital T, T cube upon V equal to 0. Differentiation of constant that is 0. Now here we have using division rule of the differentiation. Denominator square, denominator as it is, D by capital DT that is T cube minus T cube as it is D by D capital T V is equal to 0. This v square multiply 0 that we get 0. So here v and what is the differentiation t cube? Here 3 t square minus 3 uh, t cube dv by dt. Now transposing this term to the right side 3 v t square equal to t cube dv by dt. Now here t square 2 power cancel and 1 t is remained. Here 3 and this t is transposing to the left side in denominator and uh, this v transposing to the right side in denominator. As we know that from volumetric expansion it is denoted by gamma change in volume original volume entity. So it is gamma volumetric expansion. So here it can be written as gamma equal to 3 by t is our answer. Okay, let's see which option is matched here 3 by t. Here option c is correct. I hope so. You understood this question. Thank you for staying till the end of this video. Definitely when you will become success, full contribution goes to your hard work. But if my videos, my lectures, my questions will help in your success, I will consider myself lucky. Please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you once again. Take care. Bye-bye.